Um, oh, Liam, a 3-0 defeat tonight. Um, what, do you, what did you make of it? Just from the first minute, we, we weren't at our level and, and Ipswich were at their top level. I have to give Kieran credit. They were absolutely outstanding today. And when they get that first goal, they've scored two great goals from outside the box. They were the better team there. I think they've won 22 out of 25 games there. They're on a real roll. And we just couldn't get a foothold in the game. We gave the ball away cheaply, which isn't like us. And, and when you do that against uh, good teams, they punish you, and we, we got punished today. Yeah, the com the combination of the two was set up there for almost like a steamroll effect, didn't it? Because they came through with relentless energy. Yeah, they, look, they were a very, very good team. That's why they are where they are in the league, and that's the levels that we want to aspire to, and that's what we're aiming to get to. And look, if I look at a nine-game spell, um, that's the first one really that you say we, we come away empty-handed and deservedly so, but we have another game that we need to prepare for for Millwall, and I know with this group they're going to respond really, really well in the next game. In the game, Louis Coyle had to come off injured. Yeah, What's so the situation? Lucky. I haven't seen it back. Uh, there was a tussle in the box, and then he he, he looked really worse for wear when he when he come off. Uh, he's already got a broken nose, and it says everything about his character that he's there out for us. Um, so we'll have to assess him. Unfortunately for us, Regan Slate has done his hamstring, so he's looking at two months. Um, but we need Jason will be back. Jason Aquilo will be back on Saturday. ozan has got a reoccurrence of his thigh. Um, so yeah, we're going through at the moment, but this is a true test. You know, we're going through it. We've got 16 points from. How many games is it? Nine? Ten. Ten games. 16 points from 10 games. Win on um, Saturday, which we're more than capable of doing, and it's a very, very good start. Yeah. I think a positive is that you've given Greg Doherty his chance to Yeah, you? and Dodo. That's their first game, both of them. Their first games in... Both months. look sharp as well. Very good. Dodo's engagement was brilliant, made a real positive impact on the game. Docs did what Docs, Docs does. He's reliable, he's dependable, and it's great to have those two back. So look, and, that, and that's it gets the 3-0. And I have to say as well, by the way, our fans today to travel all this way and for us not to perform for them, but they, they were with us all, way, all the way through. I can't, I can't thank them enough. And I know they're going to get back really late tonight and hopefully we can repair that on Saturday. Yeah, I think I can find a positive in the sense of even though we were into stoppage time and the scoreline had got away, mm. there was still that energy and there was still that determination to and keep going forward. Lads, you have, you're gonna, in a championship, you're going to have days like this. You can't have too many. Uh, you cannot have too many. But what I think it showed a lot that the lads who came on off the bench, we all kept going to the end, kept getting shots off, kept pushing, kept getting corners. It was just one of those days for us, but that's one of very, very few since I've been here.